Let's move on to a very big topic, and that's diabetes. Diabetes is an epidemic, not just in the United States, but around the world. It has exploded, both in children and adults. Why is that? Well, it comes down to a couple factors, and they correlate to one another. That is what they're eating and a person's weight. Right? So as you put on weight, it's harder for your body to maintain good blood sugar balance. And 70% of Americans are overweight. Here's another very important thing. One in four Americans has pre-diabetes. So what do, I mean, what do I mean by that? Well, pre-diabetes is the stage right before diabetes. So your blood sugar levels are elevated, but not at the level of diabetes. And what's going to happen, it's already starting to cause damage inside your body. You see, when your blood sugar levels go up, your body responds by doing what? It causes the hormone insulin to be secreted by your pancreas to get that blood sugar in your cells. But the hormone insulin is inflammatory. So if you've got blood sugar problems and your insulin levels are going up, it creates more inflammation. That's when your blood sugar is not in balance. You can get joint pain. You can get brain problems. You can get heart problems just from your blood sugar problems. So it's important that we correct that. Let me tell you about a patient of mine by the name of Carolee. She's in her mid-60s. She was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. That's the type of diabetes usually you're on medication, not necessarily insulin, but on medication from your doctor. So she came to see me. I changed her diet, changed her exercise around a little bit, got her on some blood sugar lowering supplements, which I'll talk about, and she lost 60 pounds. She no longer has type 2 diabetes. She's on no pharmaceutical medications. Matter of fact, she doesn't have pre-diabetes. She has normal glucose levels. So again, this isn't just unique to my patients. Doctors around the country are doing this, and you can do it too.